How to fix Wi-Fi not showing on Windows. Hey everyone, in this tutorial I'll show you guys a few ways to fix if you're not unable to see your Wi-Fi option. So the first thing you're going to have to do is check if you have a problem with your hardware or your software. You can do that by opening up your command prompt. Go to the start menu and then search for CMD. Run it as administrator and the black window for command prompt will open up. Now, all you have to do here is simply type in this command ping 127.0.0.1. Hit enter. And if you're getting reply from this, then that means there is no problem with your local network adapter. So you we are going to have to start troubleshooting with our uh, operating system. So for that, you first need to head over to your uh, Wi-Fi settings. So in many cases, there is this key on the keyboard uh, that represents Wi-Fi on your function key. So let me quickly show you guys. So usually people have icons, something like this on their keyboard, and they might have accidentally pressed this icon right here. So in that case, uh, what you can do is it will enable the airplane mode or the Wi-Fi. It will turn off the Wi-Fi on your phone. So if you just accidentally press on it, as you can see, I also have that button on my keyboard. It has turned on the airplane mode. So you just need to make sure that this is turned off. This is the first thing. The second thing you can do is go to your search bar and then search for services. Hit enter and you're going to have to find a service called WLAN Auto Config. This one right here, right click on it, go to properties. Make sure the startup type is automatic and then click on apply, then okay, and you should be good to go. The final step is to head over to your device manager, hit enter and go to your network adapters. Open it up on the dropdown, go to your network adapter, right click on it, and then from here you can update the driver. Search automatically and if it says the best driver is already installed, then you should be good to go. So here Windows has successfully updated your driver I you can just close this out and go to view. Then from here, you can show hidden devices. You'll see the virtual adapters here as well. You can try to update the driver as well and click on next and it should be good to go. The final thing you can do is right click on your network adapter, disable device, and then click on yes, and then enable it back again, restart your PC and it should start working normally. That's pretty much it guys. If you found this helpful, be sure to like the video and subscribe to our channel. Turn on the bell icon to get notified about our latest uploads and I'll catch you guys on the next one.